charge at Tinumbu on judges' welfare. <laughs> on judges' welfare. Well, uh, following President Bola Tinumbu's uh, assent to the bill harmonizing the retirement of age of uh, judges across courts 70. Okay. Again, following President Bola Tinumbu's assent to the bill harmonizing the retirement of age on judges across courts to so 70 years. Some lawyers have urged the president to critically look into the welfare of judges rather than overlaboring them with work. Following uh, President Bola Tinumbu's assent to the bill harmonizing the retirement age of judges across the courts to 70 years, some lawyers have urged the president to critically look into the welfare of judges rather than overlaboring them with work. Stakeholders have said the uh, remuneration of uh, judges and uh, their welfare should have been accorded more priority than the retirement age. The chief operating officer and a co-founder of Advocates for Children and uh, Vulnerable Persons Network, which is ACVPN, okay? Mr. Ome Jalile Ebenezer described the development as suicidal, adding that the sponsors of the bill uh, did not for their selfish benefits, or rather did for their benefits and their selfish interest. The human rights uh, promoter said the working environment for judges is very harsh and complicated. The increase in judges' retirement is nothing but a joke and suicidal. Those who sponsored such a bill did it for their selfish benefits. Why did the president already sign the age increment bill? Why? Invariably, the president is telling Nigerians uh, that old wine that gets better with age is the main thing now. Uh, this action would uh, stagnate the promotion of young and aspiring judges and make them wait forever. The initial 65 years the retirement age is much better, he started. Also according to news, another human rights promoter, Dr. Mondi Ubani, urged the government not to overlabor the judges for them not to die in service. He said, before it uh, used to be 65 years, but now it has been increased uh, to 70 years. I don't know what prom prompted them to increase it, whether it is a clamor from those justices who are in the system or retired ones are lamenting that they left the system very early. But for me, if you have put in 65 years as a human being, you can go and rest. Uh, whatever it is, uh, we must always ensure that we don't overwork these individuals so that they don't die in the system. They must be allowed to enjoy whatever benefits uh, will be accruable to them after spending years in service. Now for Chief Anthony Daniel. Uh, judges are entitled to retire before 70 years of age. He noted that judges, their welfare should have been prioritized and not the retirement age. He also said the current president has extended the retirement age of the judges by five years, which is good. Now, I know that there are some judges who are still strong physically and upstairs even at 75. We appreciate the increase in the age of retirement of the judges, but the most important part has not been touched, which is their welfare. When some of us were in the university, they did pray for us that we will become judges. And this time, no one prays for such again. We don't envy them at all. There are some judges that by fail for their generators by themselves. Okay, let's do it this way. Again, when some of us were in the university, 
they did pray for us that we will become judges this time no one prays for such again why we don't envy them at all there are some judges that buy fuel for their generators by themselves which is uh, clamoring for welfare <clears throat> he emphasized that uh, the judges <clears throat> okay again he emphasized that the judges uh, sector needs overhaul now i think uh, what government needs to do is to give full autonomy or autonomy sorry so the judiciary we have three arms of government the legislature executive and judiciary they require autonomy let the judiciary go and defend their budget like the executive and legislature let them run their budget themselves he declared Another lawyer, Mr. Abdul Rashid Ibrahim, argued that justice who will uh, benefit from the age elongation would only be there as passengers to fulfill statutory conditions without ability to make a meaningful contribution. The present retirement age is adequate for any sincere hardworking member of the court. Mm. Now, it is not only consuming, but also taxing emotionally, physically, and mentally. There is a pool of qualified, experienced, and earlier professionals from which the vacancies created by their respective retirements can be filled, he argued. Now, back to the headline, which says, uh, Lawyers, charging on judges' uh, welfare. Now, the retirement age you know, for official duty or retirement age for government official duty uh, i believe was supposed to be 60. even the 60 is uh, is durable or let me say is comfortable by all nigerians now chinobu got in saying the retirement age will be for 70 years and there have been complaints that nigerians would say we were the leaders of tomorrow those that are coming on board we've been the leaders of tomorrow go to school do so many things and then you know the funniest thing is that after four years of degree program as a lawyer or any professional course they, was, they might still extend it for six seven years which is not very very appalling and it's not very very you know accommodating and now if the lawyers retired at the age of 60 or they will retire uh, retiring at the age of 60 what happens now that they will still retire at the age of 70 that means uh, students or rather those that hmm, once become lawyers will still wait to retire then some other persons will come in or thereabout or they will start having uh charge and bail lawyers that is what it is if care is not taken you just see you know a graduate a, that went to law school you know doing some other things going to, venturing to some other businesses like uh music entertainment you know in other words i've seen a lawyer become a footballer i've seen a lawyer become an actor uh, in the industry but you know not to mention but a few where this where we're going to draw the curtain I'd like you to subscribe and share this news so that others can be aware. Thanks for listening.